this is Ahmed Dan. So this is uh, the Bailiff Intramuros Hotel, and uh, we're just leaving at the hotel uh, right now. Um, I do have a separate video giving a full tour of the hotel, but I just wanted to show you guys before we leave. So this is a beautiful hotel, and we just stayed here for uh, one uh, night, and then I'm going to show you the whole entire uh, like you know trip from here to the. Uh, Airbnb which is located in Makati so we're going to leave within the next couple of minutes so we're going to take the elevator so this was on the fifth floor and we're going to the ground floor okay, so I don't think you need the car just press the G and see if it works. No, you go to G. Oh, yeah, you're right. Okay. I press the wrong thing. <laughs> okay, so yeah, we're going to the G floor. I press the same floor, five. So, it's like three. Yep. So, this is the reception lobby. Let's check out first. But I'm just going to. Yeah, just put the bag in here. And so just call the taxi using the grab. And it looks like it's going to take uh, it's like 350 peso or 380. And it's going to we're going to the Grammar C uh, building in Makati. And then uh, the guy is coming within like three, four minutes. So this is uh, the main uh, lobby entrance, and so he's just going to come here, and we'll get the you know grab uh, from here to go to the uh, Airbnb condo. So the place we are going to, this is I think uh, they have very like tall buildings. Actually, they're the fourth tallest buildings in Philippines, and we have a very high floor, which is like 59 or 60 floor. But looks like the grab is close, so we just you know go. Um, get a hop on the taxi and then I'll show you guys some roadside scenes so the guy said he arrived but I don't see him so it could be that he came in the front by mistake do you see him what kind of vehicle maybe that one no that's Toyota right 8607 I don't know where is it. I don't see him. I don't know where he he called. Did you? I called him, but he's not answering. Oh okay. I don't know if you went to the. Huh? Where? Toyota. It's not Toyota either. I is this Toyota? somewhere here he didn't know how to go to the main uh, entrance oh maybe that, that's him look I saw him where is he waiting here okay hold on I'll take it just wait and this is the old building we do have a separate video about oh, it's okay thanks about this place Too hot today? Yes, I, I you feel, it? feel it so hot, yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, looks like you're gonna. Especially we're gonna... when it rains, it will feel more hotter. 
Yeah, so looks like you know we're gonna go into the Manila traffic and then probably get stuck for a while. So these are jeepneys, most very popular public transportation in the Philippines or in Manila. And also, I wanted to show you a motorized tricycle. Let me see if I can find one. Okay, so I think that guy was behind us. See lots of motorcycles parked here so I think this is probably kind of a common motorbike parking spot next to each other.
you're going to see totally like in a slang going to a totally different world still it's all in within the manila or greater manila Yes, it's changing now, right? and you can see the change so this is the part of modern Manila and I think this is where we are going inside uh, but there are like you know I think several building complexes so we have to figure out which one is our building so we're just going to go in and ask the you know guy here that where is our uh, location so guys just arrived at the location and uh, this is actually looks like a very nice uh, lobby and concierge so someone is supposed to meet us within a few minutes and we already notified them hi sir good afternoon what is uh, live sir no 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 live no live <coughs> yes sir <coughs> i'd just like to advise you can hi right, guys so someone just told not to video and it's not allowed in the lobby and other areas of the property you can kind of video but for personal use only so I told her, yeah, uh, you know, this is for personal use and I think I don't see her yet anywhere so I'm just videoing to show you quickly. So finally I was able to check in. Uh, the guy was a little late uh, but it's okay. So starting in the washroom. So this is the washroom. I do see they have a rain shower right there and this is a basic uh, washroom, not, not bad. And then you can see that there's a mirror on the left. And we have one lady sitting there and then uh, this is a kitchen space uh, you can actually cook if you'd like and they, have, they provided all the utensils and everything which is like somewhere here but uh, we're not going to cook there's even exhaust a fan right here and then I think they like the cups and uh, plates a spoon fork those kind of stuff all in here and then uh, this looks like a microwave and then we have a fridge most likely this is going to be empty okay so yeah it's all empty there's nothing in here and let's see what's in here probably this one is empty too and then here there's like you know kind of a high chair and table and then there's another workspace right here so i'm going to set up my workspace here later on and then you can see that the bed is uh, right here but the most uh, important highlight of the place is the view so we're going to go to the balcony now and we'll show you how Manila looks like from a skyscraper 64 uh, balcony so let's see how it opens here so the moment we step out you can feel the heat and it gets very hot but look at the balcony it's so beautiful but most importantly look at the view so you have a high view of Manila and the view is like you know you can just like you know, look at the view and never get tired and I see the Pasig River which is like right there and then this is downtown Manila this is actually Makati to be specific and you can see the mountains up ahead in the distance and this is the full view of Manila. So I'm just going to be doing probably some live there later on. But for now, this is how our 60th floor Airbnb uh, condo looks like in downtown Makati, Manila.